Alright guys, so the official One UI 7 beta release is just a few weeks away, so let's talk about the One UI 7 Android 15 update for Galaxy S24 Plus. So if you are using the latest Galaxy S24 Plus, then you will definitely get the One UI 7 Android 15 update from Samsung. The Galaxy S24 Plus comes with a powerful Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chipset, which can easily handle all the new AI features and the UI changes that the One UI 7 will bring. Now, before I talk about the release date, let's talk about some of the main features that One UI 7 will bring. So, One UI 7 will bring a lot of new features and changes, including smooth, fluid animations and a complete UI redesign. Now, one of the biggest changes that you will notice in One UI 7 is the new animations. Samsung has really improved the animations a lot in One UI 7. They are fluid and smoother than before. So while closing and opening different apps or even when you switch between apps, the animations feel incredibly smooth and there is no lag at all. Samsung has redesigned the app icons for a couple of stock apps. As you guys can see, the new icons are more vibrant and have more detail compared to the previous icons. The new home screen in One UI 7 also brings new features like more interactive widgets, a new weather widget, and a new battery indicator in a pill shape. In One UI 7, you will get live notifications at the bottom of your lock screen. If you are playing a music on your phone, recording a voice note, or if there is a timer running in the background, this pill-shaped live activity control will appear at the bottom of the screen when your phone is locked. This means that you will be able to control any live activity running in the background without unlocking your phone. It will appear at the bottom of your lock screen, making it easier to use with one hand. So let's talk about the new quick panel. In One UI 7, Samsung has redesigned the quick panel which is now divided into different sections. At the top, you get toggles for Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, followed by all the quick panel controls to turn various features on and off. Below that, you will find your music player and further down, there's a redesigned look for both brightness and volume controls. The brightness and volume controls are now in the same section and come with horizontal bars to adjust the levels. Overall, the new quick panel looks really nice. It is also customizable, which means that you can rearrange the layout of these sections according to your own style. Now, definitely there will be more features and changes in One UI 7, which you will see once Samsung start rolling out the One UI 7 beta update. And in the beta update, you will also get to know about the new Galaxy AI features as well. So talking about the release date, so Samsung said that they will start rolling out the One UI 7 beta update by the end of 2024, and the stable One UI 7 update will be released with the launch of Galaxy S25 series next year in 2025. Now 2025 is just two months away, and there are chances that soon Samsung will release the One UI 7 beta update on selected Galaxy smartphones, in selected countries so it is expected that samsung will release the one us 7 beta update by the mid of november and if not you will see the one us 7 beta update by the end of november or by the first week of december 2024 so if samsung releases the one us 7 beta update we will get to see the official look of one us 7 and also the new features and changes that are officially confirmed by samsung but if you are someone who don't want to download the One UI 7 beta update, then this beta release will give you the first look at the features that you will get when Samsung releases the stable One UI 7 Android 15 update. And for that, you will have to wait till 2025 because that's when you will get the stable One UI 7 Android 15 update on your Galaxy smartphone. So yeah, that's pretty much it from my side about the One UI 7 Android 15 update for your Galaxy smartphone. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.